Okay, so for our uh, last binary lesson, which is what you call the binary division, uh, yun yung ituturo ko sa inyo ang araw. Uh, masasabi ko na isa siya sa mga tricky na pag pero same with the normal division, kayang-kaya din po natin ito. Katulad ng mga napagdaanan nating mga uh, binary arithmetic like addition, subtraction, and multiplication, kaya din po natin ang division. So before we go on to the, the video, make sure na nakapag-subscribe po kay his channel and hit the notification bell para po sa mas marami pang videos and updates. Sige po, start na tayo. So binary divisions, simulan po natin siya sa pinakasimula. Sa binary division, meron tayong tinatawag na dividend. Tapos meron tayong tinatawag na divisor. Meron din tayong tinatawag na uh, quotient. Okay. So, kung meron tayong mga tinatawag na dividend, divisor, quotient uh, sa isang normal na division, ganun din naman po sa isang binary division. So, let's check this example. Um, let's say, 10, uh, 10, divided by 10. So, ano kaya po yung magiging sagot natin dito? Uh, ang una natin gagawin, ipo-formulate natin sila as ganito yung ating normal po na ginagawa sa isang division. First, we will be writing the dividend 101010 then yung divisor mo sa labas which is 10 again. Ngayon po, sisimulan na po natin silang i-divide. The first thing that you need to, to see or to check is kung yung bang first digit niya ay pwedeng i-divide para sa divisor natin. Since ang 1 po ay mas maliit kasi sa 10, siya po ay hindi pwede, kaya 0 ang nalabas. Next is, ito namang 1 at 0. Since si 1 at saka si 0, ito pong dalawa, ay katulad na katulad lang po ng divisor, maaari po silang i-divide, kaya gagamit, kaya magkakaroon nga tayo ngayon dito ng 1. Kasi po, uh, pag pinag-divide mo itong dalawa, nalabas ay 1. Ang mangyayari, pag minultiply mo yung 1 sa 1, 0, magiging 1 times 0 is 0, 1 times 1 is 1. Ngayon, simulan na po natin mag-subtract. 0 minus 0 is 0. 1 minus 1 is 0. Now, we should, we should bring down 1. Ngayon, kung makikita natin mabuti, 1 ay mas maliit kaysa sa 10. So, normally, mangyayari pong sagot dito is 0. Ngayon po, sunod naman po natin gagawin is ibababa na natin yung 0. Dahil yung 10, huwag natin siya, o pwede mo i-cancel. Dahil yung 10 ay parehas, o yung 1, 0, ay katulas lang ng 1, 0, ang mangyayari po nito is 1. 1 multiplied by 0 is 0, and 1 multiplied by 1 is 1. Therefore, kapag pinag-minus ulit natin sila, we will get a result of 0, 0. Next, we bring down ulit natin yung 1. Since 0, 0, 1, ay hindi po ay mas maliit sa 1 0 norm manggigisagot po nila is 0 ibibring daw na po natin yung 0 then cancel cancel this out dahil dalawang digit na lang to dalawang digit na lang din to dahil po ang 1 0 ay katulad lang din po ng 1 0 they're equal therefore it's 1 then ang gagawin po natin yung multiply natin is 1 times 0 0 1 times 1 is 1 at ang lalabas po dito ay 0. Dahil wala na po tayong ibababa dito, maglalagay na po tayo dito ng 2, ito na po yung final answer. 0, 1, 0, 1, 0, 1. Okay? So, subukan po nating i-check kung tama nga po yung sagot. Ano po? So, we have here the 0, 1, 0 and 1, 0, 1. Ito yung magiging dividend. Ito yung dividend natin. Subukan po natin tong chicken. 1, 2, 4, 8, 16, 32. Cancel lahat yung mga zeros. 32 plus 8 is 40 plus 2 is equals to 42. Subukan naman natin kunin yung 10. O yung 1, 0 rather. Yung 1, 0 is 1 or 2. Cancel mo to. Magiging sagot po dito is 2. Kapag po dinibide natin ang 42, i-divide mo sa 2, ang lalabas po dapat dito ay... 2, 4, 2. Ang sagot po dapat natin dito is 21. 
So, paano po natin malalaman na, na, na 21 po yung 010101? Tignan natin. 010101 is 1, 2, 4, 8, 16, at saka... Ah, sorry, sorry. 1, 2, 4, 6, tama. 32. Cancel out those zeros. Mangyayari, 16 plus 4 is 20 plus 1. We will get the result of 21. Same result nung narito sa ating naging uh, result dun sa decimal number 7. Okay. So, let's have a another example. Let's have another example. Okay, so let's have another example. Um, gawin po natin ngayon ay, let's say, okay, so how about 100, ang divisor, at ang dividend mo ay 101011. So, simulan po natin ngayon sa pag-check ng first digit ng dividend mo kung pwede ba siyang ma-divide sa divide. Pwede ba natin siyang ma-divide sa divisor natin? Since ang 100 ay mas malaki sa 1, magiging sagot dito is 0. Kasi nga po, ito pong 1 na to maliit. Mas malaki to kaya mangyayari 0 siya. Now, let's check this. 10. The 10. Alam naman natin that 10 is mas maliit sa 100 sa 100 so magiging sagot dito is 0 na then let's check 101 sa 100 now mas malaki ang 101 sa 100 therefore magiging sagot dito is 1 next is we will be multiply 1 to 1 to 100 so we will be uh, using the result of 1002 now we can divide 1 minus 0 is 1 0 minus 0, 0, and 1 minus 0 is 0. So, lalabas po ito. Now, we will be bringing down 0. Ang gawin natin, para hindi tayo malito, isang technique is to cancel out. Para lang po, kung ilan yung divisor natin, yun din yung ating i-divide. Pwede rin naman yun. Para lang hindi tayo malito. Now, 0, 1, 0 is a lot smaller or less than 1, 0, 0. Therefore, the result is 0. Now, let's bring down 1. Let's cancel this out. 101 is bigger than 100. Therefore, magiging sagot po dito is 1. Then, baba natin yung 100 kasi nag-multiply tayo. 1 times 0, 0. 1 times 0, 0. 1 times 1 is 1. Let's, let's subtract. 1 minus 0 is 1. Then this one is 0. Then this one is 0. Now, let's bring down 1. Now, let's... Uh, cancel this out. Now, you can see 0, 1, 1 is, is smaller than 1, 0, 0. So, therefore, the answer in this part is 0. Now, the final answer is uh, 1, 1. That is your remainder. 0, 1, 1. And here, here is your final answer. 0, 0, 1, 0, 1, 0. So, let's check if this is the correct answer. If this is the correct answer. Now, and meron siyang remainder 1. So, ito yung pinaka-final answer. Ha? 0, 0, 1, 0, 1, 0. Remainder 1, 1. Sige, check natin. Unahin natin ang 1, 0, 0. 1, 2, 4. So, this is 5. Ah, sorry, this is 5. This is 4. Now, how about this one? 1, 0, 1, 0, 1, 1. 1, 2, 4, 8, 16, 32. Cancel, cancel. We have 32 and we have 8, 40, 42, we have 43. So, meaning to say, 43 divided by 4 will have a result of, this is 4, this is 3, this is 0, this is 0, 3. So, ang final answer talaga dapat dito is 10 remainder 3. Is 0, 0, 1, 0, 1, 0, remainder 1, 1, 3? Totoo ba? Let's see. Ito ay 1, 2, 4, 
8-16-32. Cancel this out. Cancel and cancel. 8 plus 2, we have 10. Now, how about 1-1? One, one? The remainder 1-1 one, one is 0 and 1. Ah, uh, 1 and 2, sorry. So, 2 plus 1 is 3. We have 10 remainder 3. Okay, let's have another example. Let's try... 1101 will be divided to 111100. So let's first check this one. Is 1101 possible to 1? No. So it's 0. How about 11? Hindi pa rin. So this is 0. How about 111? Still, hindi pa rin pwede. Kasi ang 111 ay mas maliit sa 1101 so this is 0 how about 1111 possible so it, we will be putting 1 there multiply and it will have a result of 1101 let's subtract 1 minus 1 0 1 minus 0 is 1 and this 2 will have a result of 0 0 now let's bring down 0 and cancel this out. Para lang po dito malito. Is 0100 possible po ba ito na i-divide kay 1101? No. Kasi mas malaki po ang 1101 sa 0100. Therefore, ang magiging sagot po dito is 0. Okay? Now, let's add let's uh, let's add the an another 0 since we have two zeros here. Now, is Let's cancel this out. Is 1000 bigger than 1101? No. Mas malaki pa rin po itong divisor natin. Kaya magiging sagot dito is 0. Ngayon po, ang magiging sagot po na ngayon dito is 000100. Ang remainder po niya ay 100. Let's check. 1101. 1, 2, 4, 8. 8 plus 4, 12 plus 1, we have 13. How about the dividend? We have 1, 2, 4, 8, 16, 32. So we have 32 plus 16 plus 8 plus 4. We will get a result of 60. Kasi yung dalawang 0, 0 kanina is hindi na po pwede. So lalabas po yung Sagot po natin dito na 60. Okay. Now, ang mangyayari po dito, 60 will be divided, no? Will be divided by 13. So, what will be the answer? 60 divided by 13, you will get 4. Therefore, ang gagawin mo po ay isusulat po natin yung 4 dito. Then, we have 4 times 13 will get a result of 52. 52. 60 minus 52 will get a result of 8. Now, kung ang sagot po dito is 4, remainder 8, ito bang 0, 0, 0, 1, 0, 0, sa, uh, remainder 1, 0, 0, ay 4, remainder, remainder 8, tingnan natin. 1, 2, 4. So, ang agad-agad, 4 na nga tal talaga agad to. How about this one? 1, 2, 4, 8. So, yung 1 dito is 8. Kaya, ang naging sagot din po dito is 4, remainder 8. So, I hope may natutunan po tayo sa division or binary division. So, ang makikita nyo na medyo tricky lang po siya. Akala natin is mahirap. But actually, it's very easy. If you know the procedure, if you know how it is done, then you can perform binary of divisions. Thank you very much. Guys, sa panonood ng video ko and see you soon.